Hello, it's your engineering guy, Trucker Jones. Today I will be explaining the difference between ductile and brittle materials. These terms are commonly used in describing material properties. The most ductile metal is gold. This means it can easily be stretched before reaching its ultimate tensile strength and eventually snapping. An easy way of knowing if the metal is ductile or brittle is by putting it under a tensile strength test. A ductile material will neck before snapping and I will now show you an example of this. As you can see from this video the metal specimen is being put under tensile strength and what occurs in this is necking as we see the metal deforming which is also known as necking and eventually it snaps. So when a ductile metal is being put under tensile strength it will neck before snapping. This is a sign of a ductile metal because all ductile metals neck or deform before eventually giving way and snapping. That's one half of the video done. We now know what ductile means. So what does brittle mean? A brittle metal is a metal that will snap without any sign when it's under tensile strength. A good example of a brittle material is chalk. When chalk is dropped, it snaps in half without any sign, and therefore it is a brittle material. I will now be showing a fracture test on a brittle material. So, that showed two different materials, one ductile and one brittle, being put under the same fracture test. Did you see the difference while fracturing? If you didn't see the difference between both of these materials, I suggest you to go down to your local spec savers and grab yourself a new pair of glasses. The second video, which was a fracture test on a brittle material, showed no sign of necking. There was no deformation, it just instantly snapped without any sign. So ductile metals deform and then snap, while brittle materials instantly snap, showing no sign and shatter. An example of a brittle material is cast iron. Cast iron includes a carbon percentage of between 2.1% to 4%. Here's a top engineering fact. The more carbon percentage in steel, which is an iron alloy, the more brittle it tends to be. So mild steel, for instance, which contains 0.3 and 0.5% carbon, is more ductile than high carbon steel, which includes 0.9 to 1.5% of carbon. Thank you for watching. If you think you want to see more engineering videos, please subscribe to my channel.